My name is Amy Hatcher and I'm a nurse practitioner at WKONA in the ortho spine surgery department. My name is Seth King and I'm a physician assistant at Western Kentucky Orthopedics. As a nurse practitioner here with WKONA in the ortho surgery department, I help to facilitate care for patient. I make it more timely fashion that patients can be seen. I help to see patients, new patients in conjunction with the surgeon. Um, I'm available for follow-ups, rechecks, um, following up on treatment plans that we've established with the patients, post-operative checkups, see how the recovery is going, things of that nature. Um, and again, a, a direct line of communication is always with the surgeon for that patient, um, an advocate for the patient in another way, I'd say. A lot of times people will call a, a physician assistant or a nurse practitioner a physician extender. Uh, and I like that term from the standpoint that it really extends care that they're receiving from the surgeons that we work with. Uh, and so a lot of times we're uh, enacting other aspects of the care that they've already implemented. I think that in a lot of ways we function as a team working together uh, to maximize your treatment, to maximize your outcome, uh, and to hopefully satisfy the reason you came in here to begin with, which was to address your injury. I think that nurse practitioners and nurses as a whole, their whole paradigm, their whole culture is based around caring. Not to say that other healthcare providers don't care, and I know they do, um, but I think that's something we do really well here because I feel like the very first part of caring for someone is to listen. And I think we do that really well here at WK1A. And when they leave here, I feel like that expectation has been met every single time, or I hope it has been for that patient, that they feel listened to, they understand what's going on with their body, they know the game plan, whether it's conservative treatment, injections, physical therapy, medications, or is it a surgery discussion? And then that's a whole different, you know, talk with them. I think our group here, from an orthopedic uh, team standpoint, the providers uh, from the surgeons and nurse practitioners and PAs that we have, I think offer the most comprehensive care uh, in South Central Kentucky and even uh, in the larger region beyond that. From start to finish, uh, from initial diagnosis to conservative treatments of physical therapy, uh, we have an excellent uh, therapy department, to bracing needs, uh, to a lot of non-surgical treatments. Uh, to even if you do become a surgical patient, uh, to where we have uh, the most experienced surgeons uh, in this area uh, that are practicing with us. And with that, um, uh, very experienced PAs uh, and nurse practitioners that assist with those uh, surgeons. And so you're, you're getting not just three or four years of practice, you're getting decades of practice uh, within this group uh, that has been a proven provider for this area for several years. I feel like it's a rule that I've lived by for a long, long time, and it's maybe even what's driven me into nursing, is to always treat everyone I come in contact, as I would myself, my family member. I always try to have that empathetic side and look at it if this was my father, my mother, my sister. Um, how would I want them treated? How would I want them listened to, cared for? I think it comes down to I want people to feel taken care of and I want to do the best that I can to make them feel that way. I grew up always being told uh, you, you treat others how you'd like to be treated and that's how I approach practice every day. And with a lot of these patients we form a relationship even if we only see them for a matter of uh, six weeks uh, to a few months or if we see them and have followed them for multiple problems. And I think as long as you listen to them, you sit down, you look them in the eye and you tell them we're going to do everything we can to to do what we can to make you feel better. Uh, I think patients respond positively to that because it shows that you care and that you do have their best interest at heart.